Rockstar only has two days left to pay the Florida Joker $3 million. But who is the Florida Joker? And why do they have to pay him $3 million for being in the Grand Theft Auto 6 trailer, which is the most popular gaming trailer of all time, with 145 million views in eight days for this long? Watch. Well, I'll tell you. But let's start with the Florida Joker. But his real name is Lawrence Sullivan. But Lawrence Sullivan here was arrested back in 2017 for waving a pew-pew and aiming it directly at passing vehicles, passing vehicles. And then in 2018, he violated his probation and was arrested again. However, this is the one right here that we're most concerned about because he states that if you don't think this looks like this, well, then you... Nugget. And a couple days after the trailer for GTA 6 went mega viral, he demanded this. Talk, GTA. We gotta talk. Or not, you gotta give me like a mil. And then over a day ago, he changed his hair to purple and said that he is giving Grand Theft Auto this. I'm giving you the biggest free marketing you got in tight history he's giving rockstar the biggest free marketing of the entire history of the gta thing that's what he claims and he further backs this up by dyeing his hair purple but for that he wants this for, for that i want an extra million dollars for that he wants an extra million dollars on top of the mill or two that he demanded a few days before this video that he released over a day ago. By the way, his occupation is professional tattoo model. And these are his tattoos. 666, also known as the number of the beast, a sword, a skull, the devil and the grim reaper. A close-up of his 2017 mugshot reveals Sullivan's upper left forehead. This right there is a Batman symbol with a vulgar message to the Batman on his face. Joker tattoos. And if you look over here, there isn't a single Batman reference on the entire scope of this person's face. Also, this says, Confession escrita en tinta para tatuajes, which means uh, written confession written in tattoo ink, or something like that. My Espanol is no bueno. Yo soy calvo. Muy calvo. <laughs> La pena. But if they don't pay him the three million dollars in two days, this is what's going to happen. Trigger warning. It's a little, it's a little rough. Three days before my lawyers go crazy on this case. But he believes that he can win in a court battle against Rockstar because of this. I got hard evidence. So there you go. That is why the Florida Joker thinks he can beat Rockstar, a $22.5 billion corporation that makes games that are well-beloved throughout the earth because he has hard evidence. Hard evidence. We don't know what that hard evidence is. He earlier did this. That, that's me. That's me. That's me. So clearly, he's got hard evidence. But what do you guys think about this situation? Should the Florida Joker, Lawrence Sullivan, get the $3 million for being in the GTA 6 trailer for this long? What do you guys think about this situation? Let me know in the comments and please share this with your friends. See what they think. Is this that?